Nijeku, UK Defence Minister, meet with military chiefs, support ECOWAS. Hello, great viewers and subscribers. Welcome to my channel. The Minister of State for the Armed Forces in the United Kingdom, UK, James Hippe, MP, on Wednesday, met with defence leaders and military chiefs in Nigeria. The meeting was held to depend defence corporations between both countries and discuss the situation in Niger. He met top leaders in the Nigerian Ministry of Defence, as well as Chief of Defence Staff, General Christopher Musa, and Chief of Army Staff, Lieutenant General Thorold Labaja. The UK Defence Chief also met with Nigerian's Minister of Defence, Abubakar Badru, and the Minister of State for Defence, Belu Matawale. He also met with the President of the Economic Community of West African State Equals Commission, Omar Tauri. He retreated the UK's support for Equals' ongoing diplomatic effort to ensure a peaceful return to democracy in the Nigeria Republic. He said, I am delighted to return to Nigeria for the third time in three years. The UK and Nigeria Armed Forces have a long-standing partnership through which we continue to tackle violent extremism and other security threats in West Africa and the Gulf of Guinea. The UK support ECOWAS in calling for the peaceful restoration of constitutional order and democracy in Niger. And we work with both ECOWAS and our partner across West Africa to support them in that end. He also said that the UK recognized the Nigerian diplomatic mediation effort to peacefully restore democracy in Niger through its membership of ECOWAS. Hape added, we stand with ECOWAS in condemnation of the illegal detention of President Mohamed Bazou, his family and members of the government, as well as the unacceptable condition under which they are being heard and call for their immediate release. Meanwhile, the plan by the Economic Community of West African State, ECOWAS, to invade the Niger Republic if the coup leaders fail to hand over to democratically elected President Mohamed Bazoum has been rejected by Algeria and Egypt. Algeria and Egypt insisted that dialogue remains the best option out of the current political crisis in the country. The move to invade Niger has also been opposed by prominent individuals and groups in Nigeria including the National Spring Council for Islamic Affairs, NSCIA, Jamatu Nisra, Islam JNI, Catholic Bishops Conference of Nigeria, CBNC, Christian Association of Nigeria, Khan, Arewa Consecutive Forums, ACF, and Northern Elders Forums, NEF, among others. The President of Algeria, Adela Majid, Taban, in a move to end the political crisis in Niger, dispatched the foreign minister, Ahmed Attaf, to visit Nigeria, Benin, Republic, and Ghana. Attaf, who was dispatched on Wednesday, is to hold a consultation with his counterpart in ECOWAS countries, with a mandate to make a case for diplomacy rather than military intervention. Algeria, which has a a 1,000 km, 600 miles long land border with Niger had previously warned against a military solution, which Tabunu said would be a direct threat to his North African country. He said, There will be no solution without us, Algeria. We are the first people. In a statement released on Wednesday, said, Egypt boasts all efforts started to diffuse tension in a way that promotes the democratic order and the sovereignty and stability of Niger, and it prevents escalation that could check regional security. The ministry said the region ECOWAS could e afford a military operation at present caution against it. Now that I've come to the end of the news, Please do not forget to subscribe to my channel. Drop your comment in the comment section. Share my news. It's very important. Like it. Thank you so much and may God bless you all. Cheers.